that aggressive but passionate sex. I love passionate sex. Some some women just like like getting fucked and never mind. That's the <laughs> <way>. <laughs> let's just keep going. <laughs> some women like what? Just like getting fucked and like just not no no kissing no like no like intimacy no within it. No foreplay. No like just just it's just like a fuck. It's not even no intimate shit. It's just like a. So let's describe that. Just a fuck. Just a fuck is you in your bedroom, take your clothes off, and y'all just do it. Yeah. Like, no, like, no connection, no... No foreplay, in, in, like, no foreplay in the beginning. Yeah, no See, foreplay like, but in the beginning or during. Yeah. Don't ask me why, but <laughs> I think that when, like, we start fighting, that's, like... Foreplay? To me, that's, like, my way of saying... <laughs> Like, when I get, like, real, like, aggressive, like, because like, we start fighting each other. It's like, oh, we know what this is going to lead to. We know what this is going to lead to. Basically. Exactly. We know where this one's going. But I've had both. Like, I've had, well, that's what I like the most. But I've also had, like, the really passionate making out and yeah. all of that beforehand. I, me, I'm just really, I don't know why I'm not weird at do that i don't even know why i do this but i just always like it just happens like i start fighting (laughs) well you see what type of person she is in the bedroom she wants to fight she's aggressive okay that's what that means i gotta get you rowdied up okay so you can flip me toss me do whatever you (laughs) i gotta get your, your blood boiling right what gets you in the mood to have sex uh, ooh. When a guy like kisses on my face, like <gasps> that is my soft spot, and that makes me really. Is that what you asked me? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that like all you gotta do is just kiss me on my neck, and that would be me in the mood. Like I would be like, you know when like you, like you get chills down your back spine or whatever. That's this is what like the weirdest me. thing ever, but no. like I'm real ticklish. Tick, your ticklish. ticklish. So it's like around my stomach area, like my pelvis area. If you like glide your finger down there, and yes. you like leads it towards the vagina, just like slowly, softly. <laughs> when I do this, <laughs> <laughs> that's that tingle right there. That's that tingle right there. But my neck, I'm gonna be like, oh, <laughs> gives me head like that definitely gets me in the mood that's like that's like the go-to yeah go-to okay so actually i need both i need head and i need sex like not with me i don't need both okay (laughs) like (laughs) one of the you can like tickle me a little bit you're so silly you know start rubbing on me start rubbing on my booty or we can start fighting because we don't have sex (laughs) or Unless I'm feeling really dominant that night or that day. I'll just get right into it, you know? Just start like a little... <laughs> that is not what I was were saying, referring to, you know? I'm not that type of woman. But we are all grown here. You know, you gotta do what you gotta do. You gotta suck a little cock if you're trying to keep your man, honey. He's a good man. Straight up. I, we should have had a guy on this show because I actually want to know, like, for like for girls out there that don't give do head, it, like yeah. that don't give head. Like, how do, do guys that? like? Do guys not want? Do not want what? Want to like? Continue with her if she does not. Or or would they cheat on her just because she she does not give head? Right. Speaking of head, how do you feel about DJ Khaled basically saying that he would not give his wife? wife. Uh, Do you think that's like a cultural thing or something? 
Like, like no, you, because I feel like if it was, then he would say that. I want to know why he said that he doesn't, though. But it's like, it's like, okay, you feel bad for her, so what? Why you still can't just, like, please her in the bed? Because that's what you're not doing. You're not pleasing her in the bed. She's staying with you, yes, because you are buying her clothes. You are providing for her family and your family. So it's like, yeah, I'm going to stay with you, but I'm not sexually pleased. But she I'm, is. Not, I'm not here for it at all, honestly, because I feel like his reasoning is all wrong like you're not gonna give your woman you're not gonna please your woman because you're providing for her like what the what does that mean that means nothing you're not gonna please her because you're providing for her the woman that gave you a child the one that birthed your children right you're not gonna that's holding down the household holding down the household when you're gone you're not going to please her i think that that's selfish the only thing that you're gonna do is just have sex with her just fuck her and you probably don't even be doing shit. You probably be doing the goddamn work. I'm he pretty sure about, he don't be doing shit. Cause it's, be the woman should please the man. He probably just be laying his ass there and she be doing our fucking riding. That's how Asai got here. I mean, from his explanation, he basically advised that... What did he say? He said that the woman is supposed to... Please the man. Please the man. Bow down to the man is what the fuck I hear. Bow down to the man. And I'm just gonna buy you hella shit. Nigga, no. Okay? No. <laughs> I can go buy my own shit. But Bring your head here. Black women are more like dominant and stern about things that they want. Everyone else, white women and minority women, probably even Mexican women, like anybody like they're more timid towards their towards the man. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Black women are the only women that's willing to like stand like, oh no nigga. Yeah, <laughs> like be willing to stand up for yeah. some shit like no. You know? Everybody else is still kinda living. They just go on with it. Yeah, they're like, okay, well he's the man. And so you I'm still even have black women like that. That's like, well he's the man. I'm not gonna overstep my boundaries. Let him be the man. Which is fine, but I feel like when you're not satisfied with something, you should be able to be vocal Express about yourself, it. Yourself, yeah. So. I agree. On that note, we're going to finish off this SEX talk on part two. Comment below what you feel about DJ Khaled not wanting to please his woman. Maybe yeah. there is something else that we just don't know. It may not be that important to, you know, some women. Yeah, maybe she just doesn't care. No, but I don't know. We can't just jump to conclusions and say maybe she just does not care about it because if she didn't really care, then this wouldn't be like a topic of discussion like that. Or he wouldn't be explaining it the way that he does. True. The way that he did. Like, he basically stated that he provides for her. He, what if he lying? He is. I'm just playing. He ain't got no reason to lie. <laughs> He's basically saying that he provides for her. Like, he has a home for her meals all of this stuff he provides for her so he's not going to give her hit just because he provides for her i don't know maybe it is a cultural thing who knows i don't know but comment below let us know how you guys feel um would you be open to something like this would you be open to something like this i'm i need my nigga to give me head (laughs) (laughs) i'm sorry i'm just wanting i'm not a big head person at all as in like yeah, I'm not a big head person at all, but I know that I'm not gonna not want it. Like, I right, like said, ever. Yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say, did I say that right? I don't think that I would just not not want it. Yeah, like, you don't have to do it all the time, but sometimes, yeah, but like, be. yeah, like, that's, I feel like that's a part of being a woman that's romantic. Please me. <laughs> Please me. <laughs> Like, what the heck? Yeah. <laughs> so, that's how we feel about it. So, yeah, just let us know let how y'all feel. Because we ain't here for it. Yeah, we ain't we, here for it we, at we, all. It's <laughs> a so disconnect going on between me and DJ Khaled right now. <laughs> <laughs> Turn off all his music. So, yeah, Skips like, off his yeah. songs. <laughs> that nigga don't eat the box. <laughs> <laughs> no. You guys make sure that you like, comment, subscribe.
Comment below, let us know how you feel about DJ Khaled, and make sure that you follow all of our Instagram accounts right after the videos. So, bye. Zussi.